In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create this smooth spin transition in After Effects. So this is a very classic transition many people are using, and it's super, super easy to make. So I'm excited to show you guys how to create it. And if you guys don't know about my all-in-one bundle, where I recently put in a whole new course into, it includes all of my editing packs on my whole website. And also, as I said, a whole new course where I'm showing you guys how to use the editing packs. And this is literally the best deal I have on my website. So to check it out, it's going to be a link at the top of the description. Other than that, let's get right into the tutorial here. So here we're in After Effects and I've added in the footage. I'm going to be showcasing this transition on here. So I'm using FHD with 24 FPS if you guys want to use the same settings. And what we just need to do here is basically making a adjustment layer. So press Ctrl Alt Y, just like that. And now we can make it one second long here. So I'm just going to cut it. So it's one second long, like that. And around here is going to be the middle of the transition. Here we're going to be adding a transform. And here is where we're going to be keyframing the rotation here. So what you just need to do is basically start off by going to the beginning of the adjustment layer and then start to keyframe the rotation here. And then here at the transition point, set it to 180 degrees, so halfway. And then at the end, drag it up to 360 degrees, just like that. So now when we play it, it's going to look something like this. Very, very <laughs> simple now. What you just need to do is just open up the adjustment layer here, effects, transform, and then the rotation keyframes are here. So just select them, then easy ease them by pressing F9, then select one of the keyframes. And then here we have the graph editor here. I'm going to be making a sharp graph like this. So we can start off by creating a graph that looks something like this. So this is going to be a simple sharp graph here. And then we're going to be playing it and see and just checking what we need to adjust. So this is a very smooth uh, sharp graph here, which I think looks very nice. You can make it even sharper if you guys want, but uh, I'm going to keep it at this. And you guys can probably see the problem right now. Uh, it has some huge black bars here, which looks terrible let's be honest it looks looks very terrible so uh, how to fix that is basically to uh, zoom in a little bit so i'm going to be first off scaling this up to 130 i think a small little zoom in uh it's going to be adding a little bit more impact to the whole spin transition here so set it at 130 and then set back to 100 at the beginning and then 100 in the end just like that. Then select the keyframes, easy ease them again. Then open up the graph here. Now we can make the same kind of sharp graph here. So it's going to look something like this now. A little more impact and not as visible uh, black bars as before, but uh, you can obviously still see them a lot here. So, so what we're going to be doing now is basically adding motion tile to this. So add motion tile. And then after that, drag the motion tile above the transform here. And then we're going to be pressing mirror edges. And then we're going to be increasing the output width and output height. So just increase the value so it replaces the black bars here. And now we get this look here. So this looks much better. And one setting we can use here uh, is the motion blur setting so just press this little icon here now the motion blur is going to be applied so now when we play this you'll be getting this clean spin transition here and this is basically how you make the spin transition i'm going to be adding some extra effects here this looks clean smooth and clean now you guys can also add radial blur to this to add even more manual blur to this so i'm going to go to the middle here at the transition point. I'm gonna keep the amount at 10 here, then go to the beginning, set it to zero, then go to the ending, set it to zero as well, and open up radial blur, select the keyframes, then easy ease them, open up the graph, then here make a simple sharp graph as we did before. And here at the transition point, we can actually drag up the radial blur amount here a lot actually. Set it probably at 100 to get some real strong blur here. So now when we play it, it's going to look something like this here. And now it doesn't even have the motion blur uh, effect on it. And it still looks like this. And then if you add, add the motion blur as well, and so it looks something like this now. Super, super clean, smooth spin transition in After Effects. Looks absolutely amazing in my opinion. And it's super, super easy to make. So if you guys want to save this now, press Ctrl A on all of the effects here. Animation, save animation preset, name it, 
smooth spin transition and then press save and now it's going to be saved so you guys can use it for another time basically so yeah that was basically it for this tutorial here hope you guys learned a new transition you guys can be using for your next videos here other than that don't forget to check out my all-in-one bundle with the newly added course to it it's going to be linked at the top of the description other than that take care and have a nice day